What's up everyone? I'm Chris, this is Ned and welcome to our channel where we are going to be exploring some random but interesting topics but before we do, don't forget to subscribe and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up Let's begin! Ice cream is a frozen food that it is sweet and eaten mostly as a dessert or a quick night snack or morning or afternoon ah, I love ice cream In the US, ice cream only applies to a specific variety mostly depending on the amount of cream In Italy, for example, they use one word to describe all variants There's also substitutes such as soy milk, almond milk and others for those who are lactose intolerant the history of ice cream is not very clear. Some say it was invented in Persia above 500 BC. Others say Nero, the Roman emperor, brought it from the Apennine Mountains or that the Mongol Empire took it to China during its expansion. Arab traders are sometimes attributed with the introduction into Europe, although Marco Polo is credited for it more often, bringing it from China on his travels. Did you know ice cream was made possible by the endothermic effect? Which is a process where the temperature of the outside substance drops while the temperature inside increases. So the melting point of ice is lowered allowing the cream to freeze. There's a 1744 reference in North America saying, Among the rarities was some fine ice cream which with the strawberries and milk eat most deliciously. Wow, after a statement like that, you have to try it. I mean, amazing PR. What about the famous cone, you may ask? Sure, I guess. Uh, well, the first mention of the cone as an edible receptacle was in Mrs. A.B. Marshall's Book of Cookery of 1888, but later popularized at the 1904 World's Fair in St. Louis, Missouri. So, just remember not to eat it too fast or you might get brain freezed. An automobile, or otherwise known a car, is a wheeled motor vehicle used for transportation, becoming globally used in the 20th century, although 1886 is the year regarded as the birth of cars by German inventor Karl Benz. Hmm, just like Mercedes. Uh, sure, yeah, just like it. Having his wife, Bertha Benz, as the first person to take a road trip proving the worthiness of her husband's invention. I'm sure that was a pretty bumpy road trip. Yep, just like that. Uh, Ned doesn't look too happy. Yeah, that's much better. Huh, you go, Ned. Did you know the word car comes from the Latin word carus carum, meaning wheel vehicle, and automobile from the ancient Greek meaning autos for self and mobilis for movable? The first moving assembly line for cars was introduced by Henry Ford, having stationary assembly techniques prior to Ford's idea. As a result, Ford cars came off the factory much, much faster with less manpower. A total revolution! In 1900. Japan, before World War II, the production of cars was very limited, until the 1950s, having the largest automobile manufacturer in the world today with Toyota. Did you know cars are a major cause of urban air pollution? With dust from brakes, tires and road wear. Having diesel cars polluting more than gasoline cars. Although Elon Musk made the first all-electric car producing mass possible, making contamination less of a problem. Did you know there's over a billion cars being used around the world? With 95% of its lifetime spent parked. That's something to think about. I guess. Really? <sighs> Next topic. Cats, or by their scientific name, Felis catus, is the only domesticated species in the Felidae family, with about 60 breeds recognized by different cat registries. They have strong and flexible bodies, quick reflexes, retractable claws, and also great eyes, especially at night, making them crepuscular. They pretty much have night goggles. They were first domesticated 7500 BC in Cyprus, 
but since there's no evidence of native mammals in Cyprus, it is believed that they were brought from the Middle East. Although it was thought for a while that they were first domesticated over 3000 years ago in Egypt. They are still capable of surviving in the wild, having undergone only minor changes in anatomy and behavior. As of today, there's about 220 million owned cats with more than double being stray, with the US having about 95 million as pets. Did you know the name cat comes from the Old English cat or however you pronounce that, which came from the late Latin catus, first used on the 6th century. Did you know a female cat is called a queen? A male cat is called a Tom. Tom! <laughs> That's why Tom and Jerry. That's clever. They usually weigh between 4 and 5 kilograms, or 9 to 11 pounds, having powerful specialized jaws with very large eye sockets with two long canine teeth for a little neck bite. Canines on a cat. Hmm, <laughs> lol.